all right well all right here we go so first of all i'm very super thank you for subscribers for this viewers and everything on the comment on youtube you're still at my youtube and everything i'm super thank you for that well i know that right now i'm like i'm a progress like of a creativity i'm like i'm an idea to make new videos especially on the shorts especially on the videos that are long videos i know that life is not easy for a long certain people I mean, some people think that easy, but it's not for certain people. But I want to tell you that, I don't know, I was like, I'm full of the, of the creativity and something I wanted to show I do. It's because I'm fighting for the stress. All right, the purpose I want to make this video is not to, I want to set a view about my experience and everything about my life. But I just want to share, share with you about fighting that stress. So... I don't know, for most people think that stress is myth, but it's true. The effect of the stress is, does really make you feel bad, you know? Because I know, I'm not saying this for something that I've learned from Google, but this is based on my real life. This is based on me. I'm not talking for the fake things, but I'm talking with you. Because I want to tell you that if you have a stress, it means you have stress in your life. You got to resolve that immediately. Because that is the way you can want to downfall that's the door you want to go down for if you keep that stress every day in your life it's like straight ahead sometimes we go reach at a certain point it will gonna broke your life it will gonna broke your goals and everything because i know that i'm not i'm not asking for a uh, help or something i just want to share with you to fight that stress okay so <laughs> to say that stress when you reach at a certain point you really want to like i want to kill myself i don't want to just Fuck it off. I don't want to think about it. Well, just leave it everything. Well, I don't care. Sometimes it feels like that. It's because of your stress levels. I don't know. Your stress levels has become too high. It's like you are getting blinded. So it's like you didn't see the real life. You didn't see the positive things in your life. It was like the negative things is coming to your subconscious mind. It feels like oh, forget about it. And it just, it really. <laughs> so I, I said this is really, this is really bad. You know especially for the young people right now they didn't have friends they didn't have a uh, community they didn't have anything and they stress about their life about their future and everything to be honest man if you stress about your future i believe if you fight that stress you will gonna be a working person you're gonna be successful you're gonna be champion because i know that same like me i am still thinking about my future about him because that's the way you can grow i still remember that tom plan well, the quadfather bodybuilder was, he was very, most motivating me, very much respect for him. And he was said that in the seminar, he said that you can't be a person that just, oh, just be a bad person. <laughs> Life is terrible. Well, you're going to be like him. <laughs> you will going to be like him because it's true. Because it's like you affected your suggestion you affect your suggestion and that power of suggestion will kill your everything in your brain and your goals in your business and everything it's just dead do you want to be a person that losers of course not right so for me it's like you got to fight the stress immediately get real with that because i remember that i reached my certain point i i, I feel like i forgot about it it was like of my lack of everything like a purpose lack of life lack of everything it's like Forget about it. But I still remember that if I'm just be like this forever, I would not gonna be a person what I want. I would not gonna be a person that what I have in my goals. I'm too far from it. I'm very far from the beginning. I'm saying again. If I'm still like this, I'm gonna be a loser. And I'm saying to myself, I make a commitment, same like Tom Plus, he said that I don't wanna be a loser. I wanna get rid of this. I can't just do it in half. I have to do everything what I have full everything full range of motion full range of modification you can't do it just in a half do you want to live the gym a loser same like tom Preston said of course not right of course it's not so i want to tell you that stress will well i know most people stress is myth yeah it's ridiculous they call it myth but it's true people's lack of progress lack of idea like a creativity for most of you they have the stress I just want to keep motivating you all, but please, you can do it. You can do it. You got to keep 
get rid of all that. Get rid of all of that bad things and negative things on your life. You can't just receive all that negative things coming in your brain and you said, okay, forget about it. Well, if you just be like that, you will not get to be a person. I don't tell you that. I just started talking to myself too. I would not gonna be a loser. I would not gonna be a person that just didn't have. I would gonna have. I would gonna do it. Everybody said it's impossible, but I can do it. I said to myself, I can. You gotta have to say something like that. You have the commitment. You have the passion. Everything going into bodybuilding. Well, I put everything in bodybuilding. I was like, when I came to the chest. I mean, to the workout, like in a Monday, any Tuesday, any every day. Well. I feel motivated, very motivated, because I know that I'm gonna keep. I will just do this. If I'm doing a chest press, I mean, I'm doing the tricep extensions, bicep curls, and everything, leg extension squats. I commit myself that I'm gonna do everything what I have. I'm gonna do it with everything what I have, and I feels like this is the subconscious mind that feels like everything that negative things you're gonna be success. You will be success, and I will be success. Everything will go. And you gotta keep that positive things coming to your mind, and you will be success. You are gonna be champion. I'm not saying that the most champions, most people that winning, they all get an instant like most these days. Most people these days, they think want to get an instant. They wanna, yeah, just gonna you know, get an instant. Well, drugs, well, Instagram, well, I don't know. <laughs> but you gotta really. Enjoy all of their problems. You're gonna have to enjoy everything that you have in your life because that's the way you can grow. The only way you can grow is to find figure something out in your life. You have a problem in your life, we can figure something out. That's what I want. That's what I want to talk to you. Figure something out. You can't be a person that just said that okay. What is okay? What do you mean okay? You're not okay. You're in a danger. If you think about future, if you think about Everything what you should do in the future, not in the past. Don't even think about things. I just always said straight, straight to future. You're gonna be a person. You are gonna be champion. Still want to say it about that in my life. And you know, after I do a lot of that in my life, I do it in my room alone. I just tell myself that I will be better. I will be better. I will be better. I want gonna be a loser. I didn't want to be a loser. And you know, I ask to God, that God. I leave everything on you. I can't do it by my power. I need your power. Your power is the only one. It can change my life. It can change everything. It will affect it everything. And I touch that. And you know, for a long period of time, if I leave everything to God, no, it's I don't know. It's a miracle. It's uh, <laughs> I don't know. For some people, this is a myth, but it's true. It's absolutely ridiculous. But what like that? Absolutely perfect. If you surrender to God, you give everything with your motivation, your have and everything. You will reach that. You will reach a certain point where you, yes, I made it. You will feel like I'm satisfied about that. That is the work. And you will say to your kids, you will say to your grandkids that this is me, your dad. Have been a long time fighting for your everything. I mean, for everything in your life, in my life, and everything. Everything is for you. Everything is for everyone. You want to tell that? That's you want to make in history in your life. So I don't know. Just want to share with you all of this because I know that's important. Because most people right now, most of the younger guys right now, especially like me, the twenty years old person, boys and girls and everyone, they have a lack of progress. They have lack of uh, goals. A lack of a motivation of their life. Become stressed. Sometimes become to be a drug addiction, become too much of a game, game addiction, and something too much addiction. Addiction is bad. Yes, it's very dangerous. You gotta realize that. You gotta change it immediately. So that's my message for you all. Well, I hope that it will motivate you all to keep all that bad things. I mean, you gotta rid all that bad things away from your head, away from your life. Just keep remembering, surrender to God, commitment to yourself, do it. Don't even say that. Just this too. You gotta do it. You just remember, faith without doing anything, it's it's dead. <laughs> faith without doing anything is bad. Just want to tell you that. So thank you for watching this video. I hope you all in a great condition. Keep on working out. Keep on the way track.